Hey Juan, over here. Um, do, do you feel like that there's a chance here to show things that maybe you weren't able to show in, in Golden State? And, and it feels like there's open spots with, with starting lineup, with, with just the rotation overall. Um, do you feel like you, you can kind of show that expanded skill set and, and versatility that you obviously have? Yeah, well, I want to I tread lightly when I answer that question because I don't believe I was hindered in Golden State. I think the difference between here and Golden State is that there are a lot of new faces here. There's a, pretty much the whole roster, more or less, is new. And so we're all trying to figure it out and, you know, figure out where, where we get in. Um, the thing about Golden State is Clay Thompson has been there 10 years. When Clay Thompson comes back, it doesn't matter who's there. You have to move out of the way. Uh, they have guys who have longevity there. Um, they have a culture there. Uh, and I think that was the difference. So it didn't really matter how well I was or was not playing. When Clay Thompson came back, we all knew what the deal was. And so um, it is what it is. That's the way of this game. Um, sometimes you get in situations where things like that happen. Still won a championship. I'm very satisfied with the way my season went last year. Um, but moving forward to here, like I said, it's new faces, new opportunity, it's a bit of an unknown. Uh, from all the guys coming in trying to you know find a niche on this team and so I think that is to my advantage because we're all starting um, you know from square one we all have the same opportunity as opposed to me competing with a guy who three time champion who's been there for ten years. I mean I'm not gonna win that battle. So and it wasn't a battle. You know, Clay is Clay, like he deserves that spot. So I don't think I was hindered there, but I do think there is a bit more opportunity here with the Lakers, you know, seeing the makeup of our roster this year.